Can't see my man legs, can you? Well, we can see your man legs. All right, guys, welcome back, Game Central Station. We got all of our uh, pickups from the Southeast Game Exchange mm -hmm. 2022. Um, Mike got some good stuff. I got some good stuff. You would have seen it in the video already, hopefully. There's a couple of things uh, I don't think we got recorded, but you'll see them now. So, Mike, you want to start out with one of your uh, one of your pickups? Sure. First, I got a lot of plushies. So I got all this stuff uh, pretty much today. Uh, this is from me, and this is from my family, but, yep, and I gotta get this on. It's surprisingly pretty That's cool, pretty man. clean, so I'm like, ah, I gotta keep it, so, but, yeah, and, uh, also, one more, this is what y'all saw, probably, in the video, Joe got me this pretty cool gambit, which takes me back, I didn't have the big one, I had the small one, I had a little plasticky cape, uh, coat, but this one's a, has a decent coat, so, this is really cool. So, go ahead, man. Nice, nice. All right, well, I'm gonna save my heavy hitter for last. So, uh, all right. So, Power Rangers got the big guy, and he doesn't work, I don't think. I don't have any batteries, but he's a little remote guy. I just want him for display purposes. But here he is. Looks kind of neat. I've always wanted one, but I can't afford like the. <laughs> like the real model one, you know? Let's see. Oh, well, yeah, we got our shirts, you know? This is mine, I got the black and the red. And Mike got, which one? Oh yeah, you got the full color one. Yeah, that one looks sweet, dude. Yeah, I saw some guy wearing it, I was like, that looks pretty good. That's usually what I do. I look at what other people wear, I'm like, that looks pretty good. That's why you're not, at the moment, trying to figure out, oh, I'll take this color with that color. You know, just, See what other people have and look pretty cool. So like I did. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I guess I'll take those two colors. But I tell Joe, he's got to wear more than black because everybody wears black. That's right. <laughs> I like black. So we got our swag bags. Um, we paid, you know, 50 bucks to get in a little early. Uh, we got in like 30 minutes early. There was still a line because, you know, there's 50 people, I think, that could buy it. Mm -hmm. So in my swag bag, the big thing I got was this here switch controller. I don't know, me and Mike, we might trade, we might not, we'll see. Um, and I also got, now this I, was, I thought was kind of cool. It's a dock for the switch. I just hope it doesn't like brick the system, you know? Like that's oh. that's my fear, because some of those off-brand ones have bricked your system. Uh, so yeah, that's that. And I got ET, the vinyl. The soundtrack, Steven Spielberg, and John freaking Williams. His stuff is awesome, as you guys know. And if you don't know, you should know. Now you know. In the best game ever, in the blister pack. Yes. What is it called? You're in, in the, the movies. movies. Isn't that that bad? It's pretty good. It's pretty Yeah, fun. it's pretty good. I remember playing this and I saw it as $5. You just gotta get the lighting good. Once you get the lighting good, it's a fun game. Because yeah. you, know, you want everything like kind of a green screen behind you or something and good lighting in front of you. It'll look, it's, it's really fun. It's definitely fun. So then I got this in the box. It's for the NES, just an arcade stick, but it has the Nintendo seal of quality. Mm -hmm. Had to get it, for, but for 10 bucks, I'm gonna add it to my collection. It's gonna be awesome. I'll stick that over here. I obviously got a bunch more stuff, I think, than Mike, maybe. Yeah. This, oh, you still got some more stuff to share, that's right. Uh, I don't even know what this is. <laughs> it's some sort of Gundam Bandai Japanese game. This was uh, five bucks. This was five bucks. It's NASCAR for the Game Boy Color. So I don't know, it's game, but it has a rumble. Oh. I don't have a game that has a rumble, so that's why I picked it up. I'm not really a big NASCAR guy. And then this was five bucks because the label is roached. 
but it's Tasmanian Devil. Oh, you picked that up? Yeah, man. <laughs> I had to, man, because I want to play it, you know? Oh, uh, okay. So, you, wanna, you got some other stuff you want to show me? Yeah, sure. So, uh, what did I get? So, my pickup is Master Blaster, because you got to have a copy. I did get Minister. I don't have the light gun, but you never know. I did get the the OG Shenmue 2. Oh with, yeah, with the movie in there, which is pretty good. I love the first game. I bought this actually for uh, a European version uh, for the Dreamcast because I had to play two because it took forever for them to send part two out, but I had to get a European version. I got this guy, which I just I wanted it for the zombies. Uh, it's a pretty good storyline, zombie-wise, where everybody just saves zombie. Tropico, game I played a long time ago. I just had to get it, too. And uh, play that one. Deadpool, just, just Deadpool. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, let me see. What else? Saving some heavy hitters here, but... All right. So, Sonic Spinball. For 10 bucks. It's a little scratched, but $10 couldn't go wrong with that actually I, I got a little bit better deal on it I got a couple other games and this basically came out to be free so that was nice NES max manual nice. you know it was a dollar what are you gonna do uh, Super Mario Bros U with Luigi U I don't have Luigi U which I know I think it's pretty much about just like the backwards courses of the regular game um, it didn't have the instructions. I don't know if it came with the instructions. Hmm. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. You know, new games, they don't like instructions for some reason. Blood Wake, OG Xbox. It's uh, still has a little seal on it that's already ripped, but it's cool, it's complete, and it's clean. Didn't have it in my collection, but now I do. And then, okay, so this is an important story, but, Last year, if you guys remember from my video, because so many people watched it, not really, um, there was an artist there like Rembrandt. He made the perfect cover for Sonic 2. You don't know what I'm talking about? Identical. Identical. Yeah. Refer back to my last year's video mm -hmm. on Southeast Game Exchange. It's perfect. It's perfect. But he was there again, the Rembrandt of game art. And I'm being a little sarcastic here, but it's actually pretty good and funny what this guy does. So I got Return to Castle Wolfenstein. And uh, it's the Tides of War. So I'm going to show you. I got him signed. This is a really impressive image. I'm going to show you here. Are you ready? There you go. You probably saw it in the video before. What do you think of that art, Mike? That's, that's perfect art. Man. It says, okay. We have to go back. <laughs> That's awesome. The disc is scratched the heck, but it's worth the money for the picture. Anyway, that was that one. I forget why I got this. I think it was a dollar. Uh, Stealth ATF for the NES. It looks pretty clean. So maybe it was a $5 bin. I can't remember why I got that. <laughs> um... All right, so I got a buddy who works at the local thrift store and I told him, you know, I'm into games and stuff and he's uh, been trying to collect N64 um, wrestling games. He was actually, he went to professional wrestling training from what he's told me. And so he's, you know, he's a really cool guy. Anyway, I found a couple of games for him. I got WrestleMania 2000. I'm gonna play some of these, by the way, before he gets it. Um, WCW versus NWO World Tour. Quality control. Yes. <laughs> End of, or, sorry, WCW NWO Revenge. So I got those three, then I got a couple in the box. So I got Mayhem. Nice. It's a little roachy, but it's in the box. So then I got WWF Attitude. God, these games were fun, man, back in the day. Yeah. Do you smell what the rock is cooking? Then I got this 1080. 
Mm. I think, I, like what, it was 10 bucks, I think. Not bad. Yeah, That's player's it. choice. But I think everybody's played that. That's an excellent yeah. one. Then, you know, uh, N64, little AV adapter thing, I think it was a dollar. Now this one was neat. It's a, ah. it's a Sega, Sega Genesis, Sega Master System, potentially, four port yeah. converter, two port to four. And it's uh, Electronic Arts. I don't know if you guys can see that, but Electronic Arts made that. That's probably part of some box set or something I don't know about, but do you have any more, Mike? I just got this last one, which uh, I told y'all I really wanted to get this one game. Uh, I found it, I got it for 30 some dollars. And oh, yeah, that's, you know, I'm getting my plan of the GameCube, which is awesome. So I was like, I gotta get it for the Wii U. So, yep, it's the Wind Waker. Love this game. Is it, you said it's completed? Uh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. No. Uh, oh, I mean, it has, it has the inserts. I don't know, like, it's confusing with the newer-ish games, like the Wii series and stuff, because I don't, some of them came with instructions, some of them didn't. And I just don't know, I'd have to look it up, you know? So it's, it's not bad, it's pretty clean. No, that's a, that's a good so, deal, man. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, yeah, that's clean, clean. Yeah, so, I was like, ah, yeah, I gotta get it, so. I mean, I was pretty much, I would see the blue cases, I'm like, I gotta check it out, so. And I found that one, uh, and I gotta get memory cards for, you know, 64. Gotta have those. Yeah. Okay, that's, that's about it for me. That's all. Okay, so I still I went a little nuts of, and I got me a Pelican, the real arcade light blaster. So I was confused when I first saw this, but it's a Sega Saturn oh. and PS two, maybe PS one. Also, I don't know. Um, so it does all the above, and you can reload it like that and it's pretty hefty so i don't know if there's like vibration in it or something although i just now noticed mm. there's a pedal attachment for this thing that'd be cool to come across so you can hit the pedal to reload really? and, and and duck you know uh. that would be cool man i didn't even know that was well anywho this i got for ten dollars it's like those little uh cable mate or whatever they are holders but this one is not like it's, it's plastic instead of like the cable mate ones are more thick and solid mm -hmm. but that one's pretty cool i mean maybe i could hold a yeah uh, hold a game nice uh all right so this one i gotta kind of assemble a little bit here we went to the toy federation and uh it's up in greenville really cool store and they had Master Chief on a on a ghost. I keep wanting to say banshee. It's not a banshee. On a ghost, and it moves a little bit. Whoa. And he falls. Oh, he falls off just like he does in a game when he gets blasted. So this was uh, this was forty bucks. I don't know if that was a good deal or not, but to me, I really like this thing. It'll go on my Master Chief Halo shrine. Mm -hmm. We're like moving out of <laughs> running out of space over here. Anyway. And what else? I think the last thing you saw in the video, I got Star Fox 64, the big box set, has the rumble pack in it, and the game, and the inserts, and all the manuals and everything. This was the find. I couldn't find the Sega Saturn in the box. I asked like everybody. Everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. Looked under, under tables, under all those, you know. But we can't find anything. Nobody, nobody had one, and I was ready to buy it. Yeah. But last year we saw two, maybe. Yeah, literally two or three of them. Yeah. They're, they're floating around. So this time I guess they didn't sell, and they didn't bring them. So yeah, I don't know what the heck. So, anywho, I'm excited about this. I remember seeing this in stores when I was a kid. I'd go in and play like the demo units mm -hmm. on the kiosk, you know. So this, this is just nostalgia for me. I'm gonna put it over my N64 shelf which you guys can't see right now but that's uh that's the jewel and i think is that everything that's uh i believe that's everything i put bt over here so yeah we gotta we got a stash and i'm going back tomorrow uh mike's gotta go back home 
So I'm gonna go see if there's anything else that I can waste money on. I mean, we, we looked at the footage already. There's stuff we missed. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get Joe to, hey, pick that up for you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna do that for him. But yeah, I mean, it was fun. It's just fun to hang out with you. Yep. You know, to get some, some bro time, um, to chill, to pray a little bit together, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, it's just fun, man, to, to, to have this, uh, this friendship. You know, so hopefully, you know, you guys watching this, you know, hopefully you got some friendships going on, people you can hang out with. If not, give us a call. We'll hang out with you. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I appreciate you watching. Mike, you got anything else you want to say? I'm good, man. I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, we are tired, man. We are sleepy. <laughs> We're going to probably hit the hay after this. Yeah. But appreciate Separate it. beds. Se well. <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> what, Mike? No, what? You can tell them. It's okay. No. Don't do <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, signing off. Thank you for watching Game Central Station. Don't look at my man.